everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing some of my May favorites. So this is some beauty products, some fashion pieces that I've been really enjoying during this time, and a couple of songs that I just enjoyed in the month of May. So let's just get started with the beauty category first. So the first product that I have is this baby skin primer from Maybelline. I used to love the Benefit Professional Primer. However, I just found it like really expensive for a primer and I use a lot of it so it run out really quickly. So I found this one and honestly, the same texture, the same everything, I absolutely love it. And it is so much more cheaper. Maybelline's a really, really good drugstore brand. If you're looking for a primer that makes you feel all soft and silky smooth, this is definitely a good primer to get. The next thing I want to mention is this MAC CC cream. I used to use the MAC BB cream, but now I've moved over to their CC cream and this is a C plus coral grass tinted cream with radiance booster and it is in the shade light plus this is my favorite currently it is very light it is not a full coverage thing however I do feel you could try and build this up to be like a medium coverage but I prefer a light coverage just to like even up my skin tone and this works so so well the next thing I want to mention is this eyebrow gel now this is like a raincoat mascara from Yardley. I use it to do my brows. It literally keeps them in place the whole day. I would usually just use this on its own, especially if it's just like I'm at home and I just want to like do something so that I just don't feel like groggy. I'll literally just go and take this and then brush my eyebrows up and then literally like it just makes me feel so much better. So definitely this if you're just looking for a clear eyebrow gel that keeps your brows in place. You can also apply this on top of your normal eyebrow product so let's just say you fill in your brows and you want them to still stay in place and brush the hairs up definitely get this product the next thing that i've been loving so so much is this clinique mascara it is the high impact mascara it is the best mascara and why i say this is because the brush is so so nice it doesn't clump up your lashes and it like literally flows nicely it doesn't leave like little bumps and everything and this is a hypoallergenic mascara and it is so nice the brush that is the reason why I like this mascara so much is because of the brush because it literally makes your lashes so nice it doesn't clump them together they literally all feathered out it's honestly so beautiful definitely recommend this mascara the next thing I want to mention is my DCT lip butter balm whatever I used to put this on all throughout May and I didn't suffer with dry lips throughout May because I was putting this on every morning and every night and I would wake up and my lips were so so soft so if you have dry lips or suffer with dry lips especially me i'm going into winter and winter is just not my thing i have dry skin and i just hate winter so this is definitely a go-to product it also has spf 20 in it which is really really good so definitely recommend this the next few things i want to mention is this sorbet skincare collection so i recently changed over from my oxy skincare i have not posted that on my channel let me just give you a quick breakdown i was using the oxy range for skincare they had a moisturizer scrub toner and a cleanser so i was using that for a really long time about like maybe two three years now so that was what i was using and it really helped my skin like it cleared it up so much and i would highly recommend that skincare range however i did want to try something different and i was looking at sorbet and sorbet has like really good reviews and i decided to get the hydro skin range so this is the three-in-one foam cleanser so it cleanses effectively removes makeup and balances skin i don't use this to take my makeup off i use actual makeup remover and i think everyone should just use proper makeup remover to remove their makeup and then use a cleanser i then got their Hydro Skin SPF Day Cream. It has vitamin A and E and it fights dehydration. So that is definitely what I need. So got their day cream and then I got their night cream with it. So that has just been my skincare routine kind of for the month of May. But I will be posting a full skincare routine at some point this month. So stay tuned for that. The next thing I want to mention from Sobey is their body wash. So I got this rejuvenating body wash and oh, it smells so nice and sweet and fruity and I just I love it. It smells so fresh. It like literally wakes me up in the morning. It's such a happy 
smells. So it's got kiwi, collagen, vitamins A and B3. It literally is for radiance and I really, really love this. Highly recommend this as well. The next thing I want to mention is this room spray. So my parents got this for me like beginning of the year, but I wasn't really using it. I was using it very sparingly, but now because I'm like at home the whole time, I've just been using a lot of this. Like as you can see, I've been using so much of this. This, I believe they got from at home and it is the Coast Berry and Beach Leaf. I can't tell you how nice it smells. It smells so fresh and sweet. Well, not sweet. It's not like very sweet. It's like very like, it is kind of sweet, but like on the softer side. It's so, so nice. Such a nice room spray. I absolutely adore it. So I would highly recommend getting this just to spray your room in the morning. So to make your bed, spray your room, and then it just smells so nice. On to my fashion favorites for the month of May. So obviously being in quarantine, there wasn't much choice that I had other than to live in my sweatpants. So these are my favorite sweatpants. They have elastics at the bottom so they, they really cuff in nicely and also the waist cuffs in nicely and they're so so warm. They're fleeced on the inside which is really nice but they're not bulky like they don't you can't see the pockets if that makes sense like you don't see that there's pockets like they're very subtle. I got these from factory definitely would get a pair I think I got these last year but I know that they do like I know that they're still selling them so I think it's about like 300 rand for a pair but honestly love these so so much. The next thing is this robe of mine. So you guys know that I had that other black robe with like the flowers on it. I wanted something a little bit more like chic and sexier. <laughs> so I got this and it is this really nice like purple champagne color. I really, really like it. And it has like this nice lace detailing on like the back of it and on the sleeves, which is really nice. It's honestly so, so beautiful. And yeah, I usually just after i'm like done in the shower and like doing my thing i'll like jump out the shower dry myself put this on do my lotion skincare dry my hair etc with this on just to feel a little bit more luxurious and bougie so that's what i use this for and i really really love it i got it from h&m by the way it's from h&m i think it was 300 rand or 400 i'm not sure but i loved it I would needed it as soon as I saw it I fell in love so I got it then the last thing is this bag you guys know that I've had this bag for the longest time it was my first proper official grown-up bag that I ever got and I kind of only ever used it a a couple of times I kept it like very sacred like I didn't want to use it because I thought mm, I don't want to use such an expensive bag all the time but now I was just like you know what my other little pinky bag was like giving me problems like the little latch was breaking so I moved to this bag and I remember how much I love it because it's so small but it fits so much in here like I literally have so so much in here I'll do a what's in my bag video as well but like I have all of this and there's so much space in here I promise you there's a lot of space in here so this is my favorite bag currently also very chic and it's white oh the last thing that i want to mention i forgot about by the way is these gold hoops so i have a set of three kinds of gold hoops that i got from the visa it's like these really really big ones so this is the biggest size and then they have like a medium one and then they have a small one and i really really love these so so much i got them last year but i've been wearing them a lot during quarantine because i've just been wanting to like dress up but like also stay comfy so i'd be wearing sweatpants and you know sweatpants and hoops go really well together so that's what i've been doing the last section is going to be music so i'm going to just give you my top three favorite songs i can't play them in this video because it'll just be copyrighted and i don't need another copyright claim i have enough of those on my channel currently so so the first song is six zeros by a chow honestly go listen to a chow literally go search him up on spotify this guy's voice is just so beautiful go listen to it especially the song absolutely love it the next song is called levi high featuring the baby and it's by danny lee i really love this song it's a very bougie honestly go listen to it best song and the last song that i've really really been loving is by azizi gibson it is called rihanna honestly these three songs 
love them so much i had them on repeat for the month of may honestly best songs ever go give them a listen and yeah that is absolutely everything that i have to show you guys today and the sun has just disappeared leaving me in the dark it's fine so that is all my favorites that i have for you guys today please comment down below if you guys want to see more of these favorite videos probably every month that i'm going to do them also if you really like this video please give it a thumbs up it helps me so so much and if you're new and you like this video subscribe to my channel for more content like this that being said i love you all so so much and i'll see you in my next video bye guys